The laws of attraction can be a confusing thing, and while you may often be confused about receiving mixed signals from someone you like more than just friends, the clues are there. You just need to know how to spot them. Here's our 10 signs that someone likes you. Amazing! Number 10. Slowing it down. Because of the way men and women are put together, men tend to have a longer stride length. Women have to walk faster to keep pace with men because their legs tend to be shorter. However, a study from Seattle Pacific University showed that if a man is interested in a woman, he'll forego this genetic advantage. Without thinking, he'll slow his pace down to match hers, making the woman feel more comfortable. This also makes it easier to hold hands without yanking her arm out of its socket. Number 9. The Eyes Have It this one works for guys and girls, and it's all in the eyes. If the person you like makes longer eye contact with you than people usually do, then most probably they like you. People make deep eye contact with people they really like. Direct eye contact triggers a hormone produced by the brain called oxytocin, which helps us trust and feel connected to people. Another sign is that their pupils dilate. When you're attracted to somebody, dilation is a natural response from the brain to the eye. However, it's also a natural response to changes in light levels, so don't misread this one. It might end awkwardly. Number 8. Feet Go and sit opposite the object of your affection, then look at their feet. People subconsciously point their feet where they want to go. So if they point their feet towards you, it's a good sign. If they point their feet to the exit, hmm, not so much. But what if they point their feet together? Well, that can be a good sign, too. Pigeon toes can signify someone trying to make themselves appear smaller and more approachable. Number 7. Mirroring If the person you like starts copying what you do, they're not making fun of you. This is called mirroring, and it's another subconscious action that you do if you like someone. If they stand or sit in the same way as you, if they adjust the tone of their voice to match yours, or if they start using the same words as you, they're mirroring. You can push Mother Nature along by doing a bit of mirroring yourself. Touch your hair when they touch theirs. Brush your face when they brush theirs. Maybe they'll get the message. Number 6. The Power of the Purse Here's one that girls often do. How she places her purse or handbag signifies a lot about what she thinks about you. If she clutches her bag to her chest, then she's putting a barrier between herself and you. That's bad news. If she's holding it loosely by her side, that's better. She feels comfortable with you and doesn't want to put an obstacle between you. If she puts it on the floor or somewhere else completely out of the way, that's even better. She doesn't want anything to get in the way of your conversation. The same applies to phones for both sexes. If their phone is on the table, their attention may be somewhere else. Number 5. The Devil in the Details The topic of conversation is often littered with clues. If the object of your interest suddenly becomes an authority on something they know you're into, like your favorite band or football team, and they had never talked about it before, well, they probably like you. It's also telling if they remember what you did last weekend, things that even you had forgotten about. Again, they probably like you. If they start asking detailed questions, remembering the answers and bringing them up later on, guess what? They're not just being nosy, they like you. In a world where we're always busy and wrapped up in ourselves, we subconsciously try to stand out by taking a detailed interest in the things we're attracted to. Number 4. Here we go. Probably the most famous sign that a girl is interested is if she subconsciously plays with her hair, or flicks her hair around in front of you. This is because women know their hair is an attractive asset and they want to draw it to your attention. Also, they may be imagining you playing with their hair, However, this also is true for guys, too. Males grooming themselves in front of their potential mates is very common in the animal kingdom, and we humans do it, too. If a guy is styling his hair while he's with you, he's probably trying to make himself look a little bit better, much like a peacock displaying its feathers. Number 3. Nerves When you're with someone you're interested in, do you find yourself getting nervous? Do you overthink what you're going to say and end up saying the wrong thing? Do you stutter? Do you blush? If the other person is acting the same way, chances are they like you too. We can't control blushing. It's something that has evolved as a way to attract potential mates. When we see someone we're attracted to, the blood flows to our face and turns our cheeks red. 
Both sexes find red cheeks attractive as it's a sign of fertility. Number 2. All in the Wrist According to behavioral psychologist and dating expert Joe Hemmings, if a girl hitches up her sleeves to expose her wrist when she's with someone, that's a sign that she's interested. The wrist is the softest part of the body, so if a woman puts her wrist on show, she is subconsciously exposing her softer side to make herself more attractive. Or, she could be looking at her watch to see how much longer her taxi home will be. Number 1. Compliments Reading all of these signs could be a difficult task. You need to watch their eyes, hair, wrists, feet, handbags, who knows what else. But in reality, it's pretty obvious really. If someone likes you, they tell you. You just have to listen for the signs. If a person is attracted to another person, they will pay them compliments. If the object of your desire notices your new hairstyle or says your new jeans look nice, they're probably interested. Another one is if they laugh at your jokes. That's a sign that they want to appear connected to you and want to boost your self-esteem. Even if your joke isn't funny, they'll laugh because they not laughing is seen as a sign of dislike. So brush up on your stand-up material if you really want to see who's into you. It may be complicated, but what do you think? Which signs do you give off? Which signs have you seen? Leave us a comment to let us know. Thanks for watching.